Um, there's some funny parts in that one. Um, do you want to just do like another episode? Sure. All right. Welcome back to Nintendo Play Super Smash Brothers 4, featuring myself, Spencer, and my co-host, Matt. I'm playing as Robin, Matt's playing as Zelda. We're here live on Twitch.tv slash Gaming TV, and we're playing with Dills and Smash Brothers Mod Pack. Yeah, fucking internet. Did the best. Like, was, like, slowly dying. I don't know. It's super weird Two, that it does that. One. It did that during the uh, Divinity Room 2. It gives you internet, but then, like... It's, like, not real internet? Yeah, and then if you try to do anything other than what is already allotted, then it's like... Hey, I think it might be a bandwidth issue, then. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I have no idea. You reflected at the last bit of your fucking move. Ah, oh, fuck. Cookie with me, bitch. <laughs> You guys ever upgrade routers? No, we haven't bought a new router yet. On edge. Big emotes, bro. Oh. You missed getting a grab or something? Yeah. Your next fix, finally. Yeah! You must are adorable. Oath rave, oath excited. Oath rave, oath excited. I thought those were lightsabers. Or oath rave. Looks like they are glow sticks. I mean, now that we have the context of raving, raving, yeah, yeah. But before, I thought they were lightsabers. It was lightsaber. Me too. Yeah. Me too. Yeah. Why does that last one just have like a blue heart over the face of a little cat or some shit? Some high quality emotes. that <laughs> not that it matters no, they're saying my name I was saying Helga not Zelda I think you're your sister I had more art knowledge I do em emotes for people yeah it's our problem
I guess the hard part. <laughs> More knowledge in general. I do <laughs> many things. Alas, I am stupid, and stupid I shall remain. <laughs> City. This game's gonna race. It's three steps ahead. Robin. Ooh, dee, dee, dee. I will slap you, Colter. I got act though. So shit. So shitty. What did I do? I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think what his context for that joke is. <laughs> Cause I'm in like bedroll in the city. Oh or, god! Oh, I didn't say bedroll in the city. I said bad roll. But I, either way, I, I see a, what you're saying now. I did a bad roll. Oh. I see. <laughs> I see. Yeah, we were like really confused. Yeah, and I, I was like, did I do something? <laughs> Wait, dude, I didn't mean to make you mad. What happened? <laughs> I was just rhyming. again except you're not stupid either buddy yeah context disappeared from our mind yeah we're like what the fuck what happened Coulter what's wrong <laughs> gotta love when like your blue mini comes out and like nothing happens it's great yeah it's like it's like a really cool mechanic that the game has where the animations come out and then nothing happens and i'm supposed to get one frame of invincibility in the middle of that but yeah but like where because like i never see it <laughs> Bitch. Eduardo. God dang it. That's what you get for killing Eduardo. picked up CBD oil the other day and you can add your own vape juice. Three, nice. What does that actually do? One, I think it's... I don't remember what specifically is, but like CBD oil is literally just like the weed. Shit helps me sleep so much. Because I know there's two different two different versions of the oil. Q 
THC and CBD. Right. Eases pain, helps anxiety, and other things that go in your head. Yeah, so there's, uh, there's THC and then CBD, that's right. Ah, fuck you. <laughs> CBD is its own thing. Uh, yeah, that's what. Okay, see, I see. I I I get kind of confused. It actually kind of acts the THC when bring her high down. Right. Use her head is what a lot of people say. Yeah. Dag it. Yeah, you started off really good. Yeah. Yeah, you fucking choked. DVD is like basically what the the medical marijuana strain usually is, right? So. Uh, asking the wrong dude. Survival. I got no idea. We tried to find some of that oil here, but well, they they, they have the oil, but like they, it wasn't compatible with our vape. It came in like the little special container. Mm -hmm. We didn't get just the oil by itself. Three. How much did the oil cost? One. I don't remember. And it was it, I, I think we got the THC. Well, that's good. But you miss out on your sweet dreams, dude. Yeah. What the fuck sound was that? I have no idea. Oh, that was that my that was my computer. Is that my computer oh, so yeah, loud right now? Uh, it's pricey, like fifty dollars for thirty millimeter, five hundred gram bottle. Yeah. But you like add it in with whatever else you have, right? Because I know that if, if you were to put that just straight inside your vape, I don't think your I think your vape would, would run too hot for it. But they were telling me at least. Yeah, like one syringe per tank. Mm. This ball should last me and D like two to three months. Well, that's not bad. Yeah, 50 bucks two to three months. Better than like, you know, 40 bucks of bait for like a couple weeks. <laughs> looking to possibly well the final place that sells the oil just by itself because like I said they sold it in like separate cartridges or whatever yeah that would just attach to the top of your mod because because I guess most people just like smoke it straight on like a pen we're over here with a like souped up <laughs> yeah Sports car mod that just it can't handle. Three, 
Hey. Two, one, Thanks for go. following us. <laughs> Mutilated genitals. <laughs> 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 Thanks. <laughs> oh, wrong way. Guess her stream labs isn't working. Yeah, it's about to happen when our internet gets all weird. Oh, there, oh, there it is. is. Yo, what? Here without it being prescribed. Yeah, isn't Australia pretty strict on the on the druggy drugs? At least I electrocuted you. Yeah, they're pretty strict on everything. Which is always weird to me. I don't know why they're so strict. Games. Three, two, we go. All sorts of stuff. It's crazy. We have like five to six places that have it within like five miles. Yeah, we also we have like billboards and shit. I think he's talking about to buy this the oil plane. Yeah, the whole vaping thing up here is weird because, I don't know, it's weird. Yeah, I don't know, I didn't up you. Oh, just CBD, wow. We gained an R rating for games, but they never updated the policies, which means that games still get rejected because of years old law. Mm. So like, wait, the, the rating group uh, came up with it in our rating, but then like the actual policies weren't updated for the the rating group. <laughs> That's so dumb. So, so how do you get some games? Do you have to like VPN to buy it? I'm trying to get my shield out. Yeah, I got ten. Fucking buy them from overseas or download them. <laughs> oh yeah, like gifting it on Steam. <laughs> VPM doesn't work with shitty net. That is an int oh really? no. Wow. Damn. It's out of that. Survival. Should try it out sometime. Just to test. Well, you'd have to get like a, a 
illegal game. Yeah, you, you, you have to find one that's on the list then. Pony Paradise banned in Australia. Because it's just fucking weird. <laughs> it's the wor that wasn't even Australian. That was no, I wasn't trying to. I was just trying to kind of like... Dream that's fucked with prizes and shit. And you can't gift a lot of games to people anymore. Mm. Really? That's crazy because like they've had like in, in the past they had like really cool gifting stuff where you could buy like four player packs and stuff like that. Well, they still have that. I give games to Holter like at least once every two or three months. From like home bottles and shit? No, from games where I'm like, we should play this. Oh, if the game has a different price for the gift receiver, they can't be gifted to him. Oh, mm. that's how they you see. That's how they get around region locks. Is where they're having problems with that? Yeah. All right, so we have to wait for a sale, where our prices line up. All right, let's do the math, boys. Didn't I just didn't I just give you DS3 not long ago, Edge? It was the same price. See, you just gotta line it up with the sales. Are you trying to up you out of shield is like you put in this game. Mm -hmm. Jeremiah. Jeremiah was a bullfrog. He hates that song. Was a good friend of mine. This song has the weirdest fucking change in it. Like, it goes from like a good song to like, what the fuck is happening song. Hotline Miami is banned here. Really? Yeah, I mean, that kind of makes sense. The game is crazy. I'm dead. Not dead. Definitely thought about dying though. You're dead because you don't yeah, know how to I'm DI. Fucking, I'm... I'm going under re review. Was it banned there? Oh, because it has all the drugs and the drugs have positive effects. Yeah. I, like, I think Jim Sterling did a video about it. Somebody did. I don't know who. Somebody. Can you do one more? Yeah. You can guess what those two games have in common. You'll understand why I despise my country. Is it drugs? Three, two, one, go! It's like people don't realize that adults can play games. This is what it comes down to. It's not like they, like, are nearly... Oh, well, actually, I don't know. You, you, have, you, you have to tell me, but... Uh, they're probably not as strict with like their movies, like in the same way, you know. Like there's probably movies with drugs and stuff like that in it and all that. You can have drugs in a video game, but it, it can't be a reward. Gotcha. Yeah. But like, is Bioshock banned? Because uh, I don't think it, it ever says it explicitly is drugs in Bioshock. Well, I mean, yeah, but it basically is. Yeah, but as long as they don't say it. That's why in Fallout, they changed the shit from real drug names to fake drug names. Yeah, they're going to have one called Morphine. They called it Medex because of a country. Australia. Was it Australia? I can't remember. Oh, it's too close to the edge. I can give to you Hotline Miami too. 
Cole's like, I'm gonna, dude, I'm gonna get that game for you, man. <laughs> I meant to fucking fastball. God, I hate that. Oh, that kills you. <laughs> Knockback scaling on like that, it's fucking crazy. There's like nothing to like. A billion. Zelda. Well, the creators of Hotline Miami 2 just told us giants to torrent it. They're like, we'll take the hit, man. Survival. Thoughts? Took me a while to get into Zelda mode, but I got it. Yeah, God damn it, dude. <sighs> um, yeah, I kind of like got lazy. Yeah, I could tell. Yep, I could definitely tell. Hey, Robin, and and playing Zelda, I'm, I'm I'm assuming it requires a lot of like y mental gymnastics. Yeah, you can't just like play without really thinking about what you're doing. Mm -hmm. Facing and zoning and yeah, they're two zone heavy characters. But we end up playing a neutral a lot. Mm -hmm. And throwing out projectiles and baiting projectiles and throwing out a projectile to bait a projectile to throw another projectile. You get a grab, you get a hit. And then, <laughs> and then start, start it all, all over. over. <laughs> <laughs> Sick hit, dude. All right. You just want to throw some shit at each other for a while? All right. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds good, man. All right. Uh, well, we're going to call this an episode. For those of you on stream, we're not going offline. Uh, we have a time in the bottom left so that we can put these into episodes for YouTube. For those of you on YouTube, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, share, us, share it with your friends. If you want to see some more, subscribe. Be sure to check us out live on twitch.tv slash TV. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.